In the high mountains and deep gullies at the upper reaches of the Yangtze River resides a species that only calls China home. Covered in black and white fur, as well as sporting an endearing quality, the giant pandas are a national treasure to China. Nowadays, giant pandas are common knowledge, though it has been only 150 years since the scientific recognition of the oriental bear. This is a story about the discovery of the giant panda. On the western edge of the Sichuan Basin, China, at Baoxing, a county reputed as the panda hometown, stands a remarkable structure that blends Chinese and Western architecture, the Deng Chigo Catholic Church. In February 1869, a French naturalist named Armand David, entrusted by the Museum National d'Histoire Naturelle, came to Baoxing County to investigate nature. One day in March of that year, David was collecting specimens in the mountains. When passing a farmhouse, he saw a hide of an animal called the black and white bear by local villagers. It piqued David's curiosity and thought this animal unique. He recorded the discovery in his diary that evening. A few days later, David acquired a living black and white bear. Based on its physical characteristics, he recognized it as a new species. After verification by the Museum National d'Histoire Naturelle, they gave it the scientific name Panda. Since then, the remote giant pandas have descended from the mountains and stepped onto the global stage with a scientifically recognized identity. The giant panda's scientific discovery opened a new path of exploration for mankind.